Hey y'all, welcome. Welcome back to part two of today's stream, where we are going to be playing some more of our Final Fantasy X-2 uh, New Game Plus Youth League run. Okay, we are almost done with it, y'all. We just have a couple of things to do. We need to beat up Trema, and we need to beat the game, okay? So, yes, you are just in time, Koneko. Welcome in, welcome in. How are you doing today? So, yes, okay. Make sure it loads, you can see the game. Yes, but why is the aspect ratio like that? Hang on, let's look at this. Okay, I don't know why, why is that? This one. Yes. Does that, does that look right? Okay, yes, that looks right on stream now, okay. All right, there we go. Today I learned that horses can double jump. How the heck does a horse double jump? Double jump only happens in video games, Koneko. Please explain. Okay, so here's what happened. Between streams, I did get a little nervous that we weren't high enough to beat Trema. So I went and leveled the girls a bit. Um, in the process, everyone learned all of their abilities for Trainer and Berserker. And so all three of the girls can do everything for those two dress spheres now. And as you can see, they are all level 70. Um, I think this is good enough to beat Trema, and we have nine levels left to go in the Via Infinito. So, so yeah, let's dive down. <clears throat> well, the horse I was riding gave a giant buck, and mid-buck she bucked again. What the heck? What the heck? I did not know this was possible. Koneko, how long have you been riding horses, and you, and you also have never experienced this, right? So, like, yes, I do not understand. I do not understand at all. Never heard of this. Ultima, why? Do I need to turn off encounters for the last nine levels? Because this, I think, is going to just immediately kill me and we're going to have to start over. Yeah, that's exactly what happened. <laughs> that's exactly what just happened. Oh, my God. Wow. Okay. Uh, yeah, game over, man. Game over. I hate the very end of Via Infinito. It's insane. It's insane. Okay. Let's try that again. Maybe we should put on our mascot since that's what we're going to use for Trema anyway. Okay, let's just let's just get Trema equipped. Let's get Trema equipped. Okay, so we want um not this garment grid. I don't want the one down here. I've been riding for about 16 years and I've seen it before in movies, but I thought it was a trick. Oh, so your horse just did that. They just did that. That's crazy. All right, so we want everyone on higher power and mascots for sure. Yeah, so we're just going to go ahead and equip like we would for Trema. Okay, and then I think, okay, so we've got Invincible Speed Bracer, Iron Duke Speed Bracer, Invincible Speed Bracer. Okay, I think I want, I definitely need Invincible on both Pain and Yuna. And I think we'll Speed Bracer her and we'll Iron Duke Invincible Pain. No, we only have one Iron Duke. We only have one Iron Duke. Okay, so yes, 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 okay. No, this is correct. Everyone, everyone, speed bracer, two invincibles, and an iron duke. Okay. Yeah, this is what I want to do. Yeah, she really just did that. That is crazy. That is absolutely insane. She's like, I got a trick for you. <laughs> I got a trick for you. You want to watch this? Okay, now that we've got uh, our moogles on. And we've got our break HP limit garment grid. And we've got our invincibles and our iron duke. Let's see if we can actually do this without having to turn off um, encounters for the last nine levels. Can she do it? Oh, well, I can if it's these guys because they don't have Ultima. Wait, why is Payne's HP so low now? Man, Iron Duke's amazing. Look at Riku's HP compared to the other girls. Crazy. 
And her damage! Like, this is why we have to beat up Trema again, because I need another Iron Duke. You know what I'm saying? She said, you tap me, you whack me with that crop, you tell me to zoomies. Oh, no, you didn't. That's right. That's what they said. <laughs> that horse is crazy. Yeah, like, look at this. Look at this, what it does. Iron Duke on Riku. It's just so good. It's such a good accessory. We need, we need to. Okay, don't be something that's gonna kill me. Okay, I think I can beat you guys up. Wow, did you one-shot pain like that? Oh my god, and Yuna, the heck, escape. Some of these monsters more annoying than Trema. Okay. Uh, let's get a phoenix down. She was very poorly behaved today. Normally she isn't this feisty. I guess she was tired of my nonsense. I was tired of her nonsense, so she I was being very strict. So y'all were just both having a crap um, morning today. And she was like, you're not gonna push me around just because you're in a feisty mood. I can be feisty too. Okay, let's do, uh, let's see, let's do Moogle Beam and Catling Gun. Let's not, let's not fuck around. Wow, just take out pain like that. Oh, that was the wrong spell. I wanted, um, Moogle Life on Pain. Waste. Well, she got the cure off before she died. <laughs> uh, let's do Phoenix down. Come on, let the Catling Gun get him. Jesus. Die already. There we go. Oh, wasted the Catlin gun. Oh no! You know he's just about to do a cure! Dang it. Worm. I might need to put crystal bangles instead of speed bracers on them. Might be more beneficial. Jesus. I've got you. Oh, and she's down again. Oh, no, she's not. Okay. I've got it.
There we go. Got him. Alright, we're gonna switch from Speed Bracers to Crystal Bangles so we can have more HP. Because that was ridiculous. Uh, let's see. Okay, no, it's back up. There we go. Okay. Now we're gonna rock and roll. The Game Awards have happened. They have happened. Astarian won, as he should have. Uh, Baldur's Gate won. That's what I heard. And Baldur's Gate is on Xbox now. So that's my understanding of the highlights. I did not watch them, because award shows are usually very boring. <laughs> and thankfully it was so good, no one noticed it last three hours. I think people might have noticed Blue. <laughs> That's a very long award show, but award shows are always so long. Oh, I can just attack you, right? I don't think I need to do anything crazy. Because you were that first early boss. Yeah, okay. On top of that, Kratos burned the Modern Warfare 3 campaign real. What does that mean, Blue? What does that mean? I don't, I, I don't go to Modern Warfare, so I don't know what that means. Literally the best thing that happened... What does that mean? Explain yourself. Okay, I'm not. No. No, I'm not. Go away. I don't think it tops Bill Clinton being Game of the Year last year. I don't remember this reference, Blue. I'm so sorry. I'm not keeping up right now. I'm not following. Whee! Let's smoosh this. Oh, why does... Why you got friends like that? Why? That's no. Uh, that's not who I was trying to attack. I was trying to attack the Tonberry. I literally got a random encounter while in the air about to land on the Tonberry. What the heck? Thank you, Koneko. We love our lurkers here. Oversoul, that's okay. We got you. We got you. gonna be that same. Yep, no, I'm not fighting that because I know it's gonna cast Ultima. Run away. Whee! Smoosh your head. smoosh your head, too. It's a bigger head, but I still smoosh it. Alright, Yeah, you can keep giving me this one. This is good. I can beat it up. That wasn't much fun. Oh, the burn. Christopher Judge joked about how his acceptance speech 
of best VA last year was longer than the entirety of Modern Warfare 3's campaign. That's okay, that's true, I do know that. That's the highlight of the awards. That is pretty funny. That is pretty funny. Oh no, not you, you cast Ultima. No Ultima casters. Goodbye. You have to know when to run. 94! Okay. Gotta find the right one. Nope. Not you. Not you. Is this Conqueror? Yeah, it's Conqueror. Goodbye, we're not doing that. Maybe Activision should hire him for a lead role in one of their future titles just to have a little fun and show they can put stuff behind themselves. Maybe. If he would even be willing, you know. He'd have to be interested in going there. Oh, no, no, no. I see. I see you, Elemental, behind there. Okay, sweet. That was the one. Yeah, all in all, a decent game awards. That's good. When you're on the East Coast, a lot of times those things are just also, like, too late. Like, it was still going to 11 p.m. here on the East Coast, so it was like, that's very late <laughs> to stay up for an award show, you know what I'm saying? So I just looked up the, the highlights the next morning and just read the winners. And it's no problem if you're on the West Coast, you know, where a lot of these people are. It's like a normal time for them. The winner was pretty clever as soon as they showed the wall of perfect scores for battle for um, Baldur's Gate 3, yeah. I mean, I was going to be shocked if it didn't win, you know what I'm saying? Like, it was just everyone's favorite game this year. It was, you know, it was everything. So it was so impressive compared to everything else that came out, you know? There's just no way. Like, how could anything else possibly compete? It couldn't. Oh, okay. We did end up on the thing, okay. This way. I remember a buddy of mine saying that AW2 would have won purely because if won purely because Baldur's 3 didn't innovate enough. I mean, I think there was a lot of support for Alan Wake 2. I do think that that was the second runner up, but like I get what your friend is saying, but also like for a lot of people, Baldur's Gate 3, this was their first time playing that type of game. So it did feel innovative to a lot of people. He thought Baldur's Gate 3 was just Divinity 2, but more, like, little innovation. I mean, I don't, I don't necessarily think that take is wrong, but I just don't think it's taking into the wider context of how the winners are chosen and um, how people felt about Baldur's Gate 3 and if they even had experience with Divinity at all, which I think a lot of people didn't. So it doesn't really matter if it didn't really innovate if nobody saw the first one, you know what I'm saying? You know? Nobody played the the Divinity, which I mean a lot of people did, but you know what I'm saying. It's nothing compared to how many people played Baldur's Gate 3. Excuse you, let pain escape. Thank you. God. Oh, 
A lot of people call Original Iron 2 the greatest video game ever. Or Original Sin 2 the greatest video game ever. I mean, sure, but it's about numbers also and how many people played and how much buzz there was. Because these are voted on. It's like a, it's a popularity contest, you know? It's not like an objective facts compared to previous games, you know, awards. That's not how it works. <laughs> you know, it's not, that's not the mechanics of it. So it's silly to think that, like, what deserves or doesn't deserve it when it's a pure popularity contest. That's all I'm saying. It was apparently not enough to be part of the main show. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Metaphor, yeah. A lot of my friends played, played Baldur's Gate 3 as one of my friends got me and played it, had lots of fun. Yeah, I mean, it was an amazing game. And I think because of Baldur's Gate 3's popularity, a lot of people go back and play other Larian Studios games and experience them and see what why people like those, you know? But Baldur's Gate 3 was the gateway. Okay, yeah, we're doing much better with Crystal Bangles no as opposed to Speed Bracers. But I still don't want to fight nothing with Ultima. <laughs> it's just like, we take so much resources, you know? Apparently an Atlas game wasn't worthy enough for the main stage. Are Atlas games still popular? I bet a lot of Persona stands must have been fuming at the free show, probably. Excuse you, Conqueror. Oh, yeah, I don't want to fight this thing. That's right. He's just going to kill me. I'd have to do the strat for him. We're not doing a strat. We're just a sweet thing. But popular in that type of regard. PS5 fanboys would strangle you if they heard that. Well, you know, people get in their own little bubbles and, like, certain things are popular in certain niches, right? But that doesn't mean they are, like, overall, like, popular with the masses to where you're going to get enough votes for something like Game of the Year. You know what I mean? Like, it's just different scales. You have to look at it on the scale of what it is. 98. Okay, we're almost there. Two more levels. Like, I'm just here living in reality of what award shows are and what the game awards are. That's all I'm saying. Leave it to me. Excuse you, why you do that? Pain's gonna die. Or pain. At least the others escaped so I didn't get no game over. Finally got to see what Metaphor was all about. Yeah! I mean, it sounds like you had a really good time watching the, the show. No problem. Which is, you know, that's the main thing. Oh my gosh, these guys are okay. When I don't have speed bracers, these guys are ridiculous. They're so fast. Okay, let's get out of here. <coughs>
Oh, one I can beat up. Yay. Oh, he's oversouling. Is the oversoul for this hard? Let's find out. Nope, that oversoul was not hard. That was easy. Ninety-nine. Okay, we're on the last one. Game wards felt faster because of the fact they were literally shooing away the dominies off stage to keep things rolling faster. Oh, well, you know, I think most award shows should do that because three hours is still too long. Even if it didn't feel like long to you, like that's too long. The exact same thing the Oscars have been doing? Yeah, they should. I don't know, award shows also just feel like a relic of the past to me, somewhat. Like, why? Why would I just, why would I sit and watch all of that when I could just get the highlights the next day? Here we are. We made it, you guys. Okay. We have to go save. We have to go save because it's time to beat up Trema again. Okay. Let's save. And let's make sure... Okay. We're going to need stamina tonics. Let's make sure we have one. Okay, I've got stamina spring... The spell tonic. Okay, stamina tablet. Stamina tonic. There we go. We've got 21. Okay, so I've got plenty. Sega showed up all right. Oh, yeah. I, I was waiting with bated breath for that Sonic 3 trailer. Oh, so did the Sonic fans get what they wanted? But it was to announce some revamped IPs. Oh, so there was no Sonic trailer. I understand. Sorry for that. Okay, let's do... Let's do it. Okay, you guys. Deep concentration time. We have to beat up Paragon and then Trema for the second time. Okay, we got this. We got this so good. We can do it, we can do it. I was a little sad. Yeah, I'm sorry for that, I'm sorry. Okay, here we go. Paragon time. Okay, where is my stamina tonic? I shouldn't have chosen high potion, I should have chosen something way better. Let me get their health up, so we don't waste that stamina tonic. They just don't beat up on pain. Maybe Rockstar would show? Oh, oh shoot, I gotta concentrate. Okay, let's do... Let's do a mega potion. Oh no. Pain's dead. Yuna might be dead too. Yep. Fuck. That was not smooth. Oh, and we're dead. We're all dead. Oh no, Riku's still alive! Oh, not Mega Phoenix, I meant to Mega Potion. Whatever. Okay, 
we're starting this over. We're starting this over. Mega Phoenix doesn't heal to full in this game. No, it does not. No, it does not. Okay, we're going to be smoother this time. I did not execute the beginning of that very well. All right, Paragon, you're mine. You're not gonna last long. Okay. Uh, Heartland Gun. Rubble Beam. Uh, Stamina Tonic. Make a potion. Did you see my 2025 comment? No. I can't really read too much while I'm doing this because it's actually a challenging fight and we are not level 99 like we were before. Damn it. Killed pain. This was so easy before. Maybe I was wrong in thinking I didn't need to level up so much. Uh, let's do Phoenix down on pain, and then a mega potion. Let's do an X potion, uh, Mega potion. And an X potion on him. And Mega potion. Okay, we should all survive Genesis now. X potion on Riku. on clean. Oh, but Yuna's probably dead. Yep, she's dead. Okay. So let's do... Who am I on? I'm on pain. Let's do Catling Gun. And let's do Phoenix Down on Yuna. Maybe I do need to level. Maybe I can't do this in the 70s.
Okay, let's try again with the stamina tonic. He's about to do. Yep, so I get a Phoenix down pain. Don't kill Yuna. Let her live. At least Riku can survive with her Iron Duke and Crystal Bangle. My god. I guess I was right to get to level 70. <laughs> at least, uh, at least, at least that's true. I should not have been in the 60s.
got to be dead soon. Can only survive without a mantite. <laughs> no, no, I don't think you need an amantite. I know some guides say that you need it, but I do not think that's the case. Damn it. This is a new game plus blue. That's why I didn't get all the way to 99 because I have good accessories, so I don't, I shouldn't need to get all the way to 99 to do this. God damn it. I'm gonna, I might have to level up. Like, I think this is harder than I thought it was. I'm using so many items and I'm not even at Trema yet. Okay, let's think. Let's think. How do I wanna do this? I really do not like how this is going. I don't think this is how it should be going. The Iron Duke is, Duke is an end game. Yes, yeah it is. And Riku has it on, equipped. I do not like how this run is going. But I'm trying to debate, like, do I invest in leveling up? I don't know.
Alright, Pain's dead again. Okay, there we go. I don't know how much progress it potentially erases if we leave this place. None. I saved right before. And leveling up is easy. Okay, well, we're past that phase. Now we have to actually beat up Trema. We can do this. We can do this. I did all that work and Trema just come kick his ass for me. That's so rude. So, you're Trema. Yup, he's unsent. Please tell us, why did you hide the spheres of Spira's past? Humans, so hopelessly entangled with their past. I had to seal away that past in order to guide them to the future. Whatever, Trema. You dumb. So what is that supposed to mean? Well, what happened to everyone's spheres then? Destroyed. Turned to fireflies and scattered. So rude. How could you? How could you to for guide real? The youth charged with Spira's future, I provided them with a training academy. But then came the call. Welcome back, and Blue. Before long, I realized you didn't miss anything, error. just the cutscene. In Sin, Spira's youth had an enemy. Without it, they waved their swords at shadows, eager for a foe. Their hearts, you see, were not made of the same tempered steel as their swords. I knew what I had to do to forge their hearts anew. Erase the past. Expunge it. Nostalgia makes the heart feeble. It is the heart's nemesis. Trauma, you just Only talking crazy now. Crazy nonsense. Everything possesses the strength to transcend anything. Hi, Summoner Yuna. Yeah, we made it. We got we got past Paragon. We're on Trema now. So let's see how this goes. <laughs> what do we have to do after Via Perfico? Just beat the game. The strength that you have gained. Okay, let's do it to it.
let's make sure everybody... Did I already stamina tonic? We're gonna do it again, just in case. Alright, Riku, hit him with the rest of our mega potions. Oh, brought Omega Potions, okay. <clears throat> what do we have? We have Elixirs, we have Mega Elixirs, okay. Um, skip return. I didn't mean to turbo ether Yuna, that was a waste. I meant to turbo ether pain. Queen. I hear you meow meowing. I've beaten up this guy right now though. Hello. 
Meow. Yeah, I hear you. I will pet you when this fight is over. She missed! Always oh, trying to get the. Ah, uh, rude. We out of X potions now too. We are okay. So we need. Uh, let's see. Let's do an elixir. Try to make a chain. Oh, it didn't work. Hey, got that chain. about to be the Ultima. Will they all survive? Oh no, it's a Demi. Okay.
Oh, what's he about to do? Oh, Meteor. Okay. Oh, Lord. Alright, Yuna's gone, but Riku and Pain are both still up. Okay. Okay, so step one. Let's do an elixir on Riku. Get her fully back up. Alright, then we will... Hey! Thank you, Lunar! Thank you! Alright, then we're gonna... Phoenix down Yuna. Gonna stamina. Yeah, stamina tablet, Yuna. And then elixir, Yuna. There we go. I love it when he casts player on Riku instead of the other girls. That's nice. 
Oh, I'm starting to get nervous. This is going on a while. Come on, we can do this. Here's Meteor again. I think Yuna's dead again. Oh no, she's not! She's not, she's not! Okay. Fabulous. Okay, can we survive this? I think Yuna's dead. Are you in pain, maybe or not? <gasps> Nobody died. Nobody died. Nobody died. Oh my god. Oh, but Yuna did. <laughs> With the hit afterwards. <gasps> okay, okay. Uh, Alright, Phoenix down on Yuna. Okay, if he's casting Ultima, he's getting close. Okay, Phoenix down, and then we're gonna do... Where's the stamina? Uh, oh, we're out of those. We just have stamina tonics. Okay, that's fine. Stamina tonic. And then let's do elixir on Yuna. Oh wait, that's pain.
did it! Okay, that took forever compared to last time, but we did it. Holy shit. Yes. Yes. Okay. Yes. We did it. You are the paragon of postlessness. Another Iron Duke coming Your our home. way. Although I've wished to be stronger and I've wanted to change, I realize that losing my past would mean losing myself. <laughs> Tell me, I Summoner Yuna, where is the loss in that? Good question. Good question, Trema. You're full of good questions, but you know what? You don't know what the heck you're talking about. You don't know what the heck you're talking about because I just beat you up. I just totally beat you up and I won. All right. So all we have left to do now is beat the game, you guys. We just have to beat the game. Oh my God. We're almost done with this run. And then we can start a new one. All right, let's save. Okay, now doing the whole finale sequence does take about um, two hours to do um, based on kind of what level we are and uh, and all of that stuff. Like, yes, we have like the Iron Dukes and everything, but it's still going to take around two hours. So, because um, there's like just a ton of cutscenes. But look at this, we can equip two Iron Dukes now. The heck? Look, we've got a second one! <sighs> Look at that. Oh, that's so good. It's so good. Okay, we're gonna board the airship. But yeah, it takes about two hours to do the finale. So, we are actually gonna do the finale tomorrow. We're gonna finish this run up tomorrow. Let me see, let me think, let me think. Okay, but you know what we can do? You know what we can do before then? We can go ahead and jump in the hole. Up your mind. Where will jump in? We can go ahead and jump in the hole. Uh, let's do... Yeah. The Bell Underground. Here we go! Let's do the first part of the little ending sequence. Yeah! The time for invasion has come! Spear Hunter Team go with... Uh -huh. Your friendly me! Huh? Yeah. What are we called now? <laughs> You're still called the Gull Wings. I don't know why he does this. Like, why is their name not Gull Wings anymore? Searching, flapping, neighboring Gull Wings. There you go. Whoa, such passion. <laughs> Seriously. I'm so moved. At any rate, let's go. The Gull Wings' last mission. Let's Was he trying to say friendly neighborhood going? Is hey, that hey, what's hey, going on there? This last mission business, you hear? Yeah, Shinra, stop me, it. It probably will be. Don't be like that. Be careful. I'll be fine. We're just going to talk after all. Hmm. Save the huggy huggies for your triumphant return. Yes. Hug, 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 hug. hug, hug. <laughs> Um, hey, look what the boys thought of. That's right! Oh, the boys are gonna do their thing. Oh, I love this. Go wings! <laughs> it's time, go wings! Let's rock! Hell yeah. Let's go. Jump in. We don't have to run down all the paths this time. So I don't know, maybe it won't take two hours because there was a decent amount of time on each of the paths before. There may be only one. So we'll see. We'll see what we can finish today. Oh, we don't need mascots on. 
I can swap it. Oh, oh my gosh, I'm still on the... We can just attack. We can just attack. There we go. You don't have to Moogle Beam. You don't have to Moogle Beam, Yuna. Oh, excuse me. But I don't have to use this crazy garment grid or any of this. We can go back to, uh... We can go back to what we were doing before. Yeah, this one. And she was working on Psychic. And Riku was working on Alchemist. And Pain was working on, yeah, Dark Knight. Okay. There we go. That's plenty. We don't need to overkill it. Especially before we even get to the final part. Hi there. And watching a wreck with both Invincible and Iron Duke, the heck? Piece of cake, <clears throat> Piece of cake indeed. All right, Shiva, come on. Hey, girl. How you doing? Having fun? We're about to. Sorry. Sorry that was uh, so fast for you, Shiva. Sorry. Not usually like this, but you know. Okay, so she oh she still needs to learn this in time trip oh and one other, okay. There we go. Don't need to be over killing it on mascots, we can level up some of our other dress spheres. I wonder now that we have two Iron Dukes, if when we go for New Game Plus number three, when we go to, for round three, um, so I guess New Game Plus number two, if uh, if we even need to be level 70 to beat Trema, if we can do it even lower. I mean, because it was kind of hard getting past Paragon, but once we got to Trema, honestly, it was just, it wasn't that bad. Like, it could have been way worse. Oh wait, yeah, this guy needs magic to beat him. Do I have any? Oh man, that doesn't work either. Does darkness work? Oh yeah, darkness works. Maybe I can mix. Maybe I can mix some of this crap. Let's see, does any of this do anything? Nullifies magic. Oh, cluster bomb! It didn't do anything. Okay. Uh, what if I mix? There's enough pain to go around. What if I mix like two ice gems? And it like blizzards in. How many darknesses we have to do to a kill this guy? There we go. That should get him. Next platform. Oh my gosh. I 
I guess you can attack this guy. Hey, lady. Come here. I'll pet you. I'm not fighting the crazy thing anymore. There we go. Now he's down. down lady. Too him. easy. I mean, it was easy, but it was also a little annoying, you know, like, let's be real. Since you can't physically attack him. But we can physically attack these guys. Hey, friends. It's a party, three on three. You're gonna walk in front? Of course you are. Of course you are. Hey! <laughs> Is it your stream now? You beat in the game? Yeah? You strong? You you would have beat Trem away faster? I bet you would have. I bet you would have. I bet you would have, lady. Hey, <laughs> you want to crawl in my lap? You can sit in my lap. Oh, she learned Black Sky. I think that was the only thing she needed from um, not knowing that she didn't know on Dark Knight. That's cool. Let's have to see what else she can learn. What other dress sphere she needs. Let's do some potions. Oh, wait, I should sort. There we go. Okay, uh, let's look at Kane's abilities. I think she's done. Yeah, she's got all of her Dark Knight abilities. Okay, what's next? So she's got 14% on Warrior. Oh, 49% on Lady Luck. We should finish out Lady Luck with her. And she's closest to that. There we go. Uh oh. But now we don't have magic attacks, so we'll run from this guy. <laughs> Oh, but we'll beat you up. See that? I think the psychic teleport was disabled on this fight. I have to peek at that again when we go to Yuna. Yeah, teleport is disabled. That's funny. You're only allowed to stand in front of Anima. That's all that, that's all that you can do.
It's Bahamut. Yuna. I'm sorry. We weren't strong enough to stop him. We wanted to at least warn someone, but instead, we were dragged into the darkness. Hmm. We're no better than fiends. It's all right. Forgive us. Please, tell me, what is he? Shuyin? Just a shadow. It may look like him, but the real Shuyin died long ago. Even after a thousand years, his hate and misery linger on. I feel like Bahamut's a bit quiet. We'll turn his it up. feelings grew so strong they began to act on their own. Eventually, they became a shadow. A shade that there wants we go. only to vanish, but cannot. Just a shadow. I can handle a shadow. Are you sure? Yes, leave it to me. I'll banish shadow with light. Light? Lens feelings. That's right. Call it love. Pain gets it. But Blanc, what are you doing here? Hey! <laughs> you certainly took your sweet time. Why are you here? Because the boss never goes against Lord Nuji's wishes. You found him? As we was heading in, we found the sphere addressed to the boss. He said, <clears throat> Don't follow me. Turn back now and wait for my return. Wow. Actually doing what you're told? How novel. <clears throat> what can I say? One look at Nuji Wuji's dashing visage on that sphere and I was, oh, charmed. How could I say no to such a cutesy, wootsy face? Whatever you say, LeBlanc. Whatever you say. What if he... Don't worry. If he knows you're waiting, he has a reason to come home. Hmm. That's kind of true. <sighs> and wait, I shall. We'll tell him that you're waiting like a good girl. You do that, love. And don't forget to stress, good girl. All right, so when we go down there, that's where it's gonna be boss time. So we're gonna go ahead and save right here. And tomorrow, when we return, we will be beating this game. Okay, so. Thank you guys so much for joining me today. Um, we're almost done with this second round. I thought we might finish it this time, but gosh, Paragon took much longer than I thought. So uh, we're going to fully finish tomorrow during stream. Um, we're going to be streaming from 12 until 4 tomorrow, just like we did today. And it's all Final Fantasy X too. So I will see you then. If you're watching on YouTube, thank you so much for watching. Your next episode will also be up tomorrow. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. And of course, as always, don't forget to make it a great day.